So the best way for me to unpack what heart rate variability is, um, is to provide a definition, an operational definition, but then also talk about not just what it is, but how it can be utilized. Um, how can we put it into practice? Because I think that's the big gap for people is that they hear about this data, but then they say, well, what do I do with that data? What is this informing me of? How can I actually make uh, an, or implement changed based on what I see? So when we think about heart rate variability or HRV, as most people commonly refer to it as, is that the 30,000 foot view of this is that it is the single greatest non-invasive proxy that we have for assessing or looking at the dynamic shifts in the nervous system. Another way to put so that- So if you ever, because just to pause you here, and, and sorry for the interruption, okay. <laughs> uh, and by the way, you can interrupt me uh, <laughs> whenever you want. So just to break that down, because that's like a big statement for mm -hmm. a lot of people, and I want to kind of connect the dots on it. What I find, the, the more that I got into the world of health, the more I realized that a lot of times people don't know that they're actually stressed. 